I was holding its mouth so it wouldn't beat me. And then I took a better look and it was a seal, I was like, F Um, so the wounds are not too bad, it's just one of the, so when it, it beat my arm, like luckily I had the wetsuit and it kind of protected me pretty well, just one of the teeth that actually were like punctured through the wetsuit and punctured like through the skin. Uh, so I would say that's like, it's a big thing, but it's not like really that big. And then it was only when I, when I was like grabbing the teeth from underneath and like opening the mouth, that's when I got a few cuts on my, on my hand. Family just went for a swim in the ocean, and I was unlucky enough to swim towards the side where there was a seal. When I saw it, I kind of didn't know what to do, and it started swimming towards me. Got very close, kind of like, kind of felt like a dog like smelling me, and I kind of just tried to like slowly, like without doing anything aggressive, like push it slowly away. And then at a certain point, there was like a wave, like kind of a strong wave that pushed it against me and I like a bit aggressively pushed it away then because it was like then it was really on me and then it got scared and beat my arm <laughs> and just wouldn't let go uh, so I had to like hold on to it like try to grab the teeth from under like between the mouth and my arm uh, open the mouth and yeah try to get it away and then I just wanted to swim away but I didn't quite know what I should do with the seal though, because I was like, if I just let go, it's gonna bite me again. You don't think about dying, I think. Like, it's more like, I was more thinking about surviving. So like, when it beat me, I was like, how do I get out of this situation? I did think it could get worse. Like, when it beat me, I was like, oh shit, like, because if it gets aggressive, it could like bite me anywhere. Like, it moves so much faster than me. I didn't have the thought of dying. I had more the thought of surviving in my head, I think.